here we are again. Thank you for following th uh, my YouTube. I'm Alan Cook, as those who have been following know. And this is the younger Mona Lisa. This is the more mature Mona Lisa. This painting's called Me Dion. I was honored to be able to uh, come across it. I own it and have had it for quite some time in my life. Um, stumbling on uh, the images in it uh, for quite some time also and as those who know about the YouTubes have um, been odd about all the items that are hidden within my painting that is in the uh, Mona. I've uh, broken uh, quite a bit of his codes and I have uh, uh, found of many of his little secrets um, but uh, that's only many in the sense of what I uh, uh, count. Uh, his uh, secrets uh, dominate, uh, my opinion, a million times, I'm sure. He's, he's definitely uh, beyond my uh, realm. But, uh, and I always get excited on every single one. Every day of my five years, I've been uh, at least five years I've been doing this uh, I've always had to take about a 15 minute break on something else he's excited me on this sense of unbelievable okay now I'm gonna show you the image again that is in the flaming Mona Lisa which is this particular one right uh, here and this flaming one is of um, the particular area, this this flaming one, which I'll get up a little bit, it's going to be right in this area, one little dot. Um, and then uh, you will see another piece of artwork, which is this piece of artwork of his that he has done of a sketch and um, that fits inside, I call it, the flaming Mona Lisa. So, let me put this over. We're going to be working in this area right here today, and this is the ermine, and you will see the other ermine in here. There is two ermines, and more than one faces, uh, tons of them. So I place this here, and you can see how it fits exactly in the fit. And then you pull this down, and there's another ermine hidden in between. And you pull this up and it's right here and then you pull it down and you see the outline what he did is he hit it just like he hit it every single thing of his now the first sermon I, I was talking about you pull you pull this down you can see how the black ears line up in here and you'll see these little black doodads around here it is that's what this is this light. Now you'll also see his bright uh, pronounced eyelash watch. Okay, it's right here. Yep, see it moved. I moved. Ugh, it's tough. Right there. See, I got to get the nose lined up on this one. And you pull it down. There's the eyelash. There it is right here, the eyelash. And when you actually look at it, the eyelash helps build the eight. So when you pull this down, you see this. But if you close off this one particular spot here, you have your zero and zero. And here's three zeros, 
which actually comes out one, two, and then when you close this, it's the third. So when you lay this back up here, right nose, here's the tip of the nose of the little animal, and the mouth and everything, perfectly there. Now, it's very unusual, very hard for me to get that to be perfect, because normally it will only show a smaller portion than what it is this time, but we're fortunate, because what he does is he makes it go like this. See, if you, if you see, if you see the background, how this floats a little, so he's, he's running it. He's telling you how he's running it. So this, if, okay, what's a mom do to the children? They rock them. This is what they're doing. They're rocking them. Rock them, my baby. Of course, I don't have any children, so uh, you got to help me out here. Okay, and so when this goes, you'll also see, like I said, the other one which is right here and you put it up and you see it right there now I pull it back down there it is and then if you look off to the side here's the outcome that he has hidden now the, these are like um, neon or something uh, or bright bright deals now I'm gonna tell you something real quick here to let you know before I uh, say goodbye I want to make it a quickie here uh, these each little in the spots these one little dot these little dots if I was to blow them up I can blow them up if I got the clarity I can blow them up huge but the, this this whole image right here is originally about the size of um, that one I do believe maybe a little bit hair bigger probably in between this one this white and this bluish in between uh, maybe uh, maybe this one probably it's real close so this image is really supersized. Now, um, he was a trickster. Now, if I really wanted to, uh, well, I'll do it on the next YouTube because I want to do a couple short ones, get some of you guys um, uh, for your little five-minute breaks. Anyway, I want to say keep following. Thank you for the thumbs up. God bless um, the whole world universe and the heavens. Amen.